Oh, hi. So I am in the midst of this piece. It has been in my husband's family for forever. Like it's a vintage piece anyways. And then I think they got it when it was already used. So um, I'm revamping it, making it awesome again. However, it has two terrible coats of paint on it um, with drips and all that kind of stuff. We did try to do sanding on it, which didn't do a lot of good because um, they use latex paint, which gums up the sander and just doesn't go really smooth. I don't like using chemicals because I always have my little one around and I just, I don't want to have to deal with that. So I'm using chalk paint. And then on the sides where you can see like all the icky drip marks, I'm going to show you, but it's really hard to see because, um, it has a scuff sand on it right now. And, uh, I think the light is not the best, but we'll try. Hold on. Okay, so yeah, it's really hard to see. But like this area right here is really is the worst of it. Um anyways, so I have this stuff here. It is lightweight spackle. I have used it before for ray stenciling, but since I don't want to do too much fussing with it, I thought I would try and tint it with this throwaway paint that I just have. I, I don't use it for anything. It's just, I got it a long time ago. It was really inexpensive. Um, it says interior, exterior, it's Martha Stewart, home decor, yada yada. Anyways, I'm gonna try and tint this with this. And it's kind of a complimentary color, so I feel like it will be okay. We're gonna see how that goes. And I thought I would just take you along with me and see what happens. So if I fail, awesome. If it doesn't fail and it turns out fantastical, it will be a really fun thing to show and, you know, be able to do again next time. So let's try this. Alright, so this is dried overnight. It worked perfectly. I'm super excited about it. I just gave it a quick sanding. Um, I'm probably going to end up painting over this, but as you can see, it's really on here. It actually worked better with the paint in it because this lightweight spackle, um, I usually don't get a... It's not secured on there until my final like clear coat, and this feels really, really secure. So that's awesome. I'm going to continue doing that. P.S. This stuff is from the dollar store, so even if I wrecked it, I wasn't going to be sad about it because I could have just taken it off and this is, you know, a dollar. Anyways, totally recommend it. Going to be continuing doing that. I'll put in whatever color paint I want now, um, just so that I know for the future. But I just intended on painting over this anyways, and then I'm going to do some stuff to make it stand out. But awesome thing. You should try it. 
Okay, bye.